how to draw a weathercock. And this is kind of inspired by um, Chinese New Year, uh, because this is 2017, and it's the year of the rooster. You might say it's, it, you might say it's year of the chicken, but in fact, it's a sort of. I'm told that it's particularly the rooster. So I'm just kind of planning this here. That would be east, that would be north, and that would be south. So we want to come all the way around like that. And then a little pokey bit like that. Now, of course, the the cockerel on, uh, on a weather vane is not a real one. It's made out of metal. So uh, we want it to be quite simplified. And I'm going to go up and around and around and kind of wiggle, wiggle, wiggle around with this comb like that. And I suppose I hadn't really thought about it. it really should have a, a wattle there as well. And then I'm going to sweep this body around to there. And then this part here is called the saddle. And then we're going to go up and curve and down and curve and down and curve. So, of course, this is the bit that catches the wind and swings the whole thing around, <laughs> otherwise known as a tail, of course. Um, and then we want to draw some feathers. So it needs to look a little kind of metallic. So we might do something like that as well. That's going to be a little bit there. And draw a little curve like that. And then we'll have a bit sticking out there and a bit sticking out there and then a curve underneath and then here we'll be able to draw W like that and that probably wants to look a bit 3D as well so we go across there and down across there and then down in there and on the inside and then here we want to have the S, which will be probably in about there. So we'll come around like that, there. And we want this to look a little bit 3D as well, because it's sort of made out of metal. Uh, then this can come down to there, and then we can have a little bit on there. And then this is going to be kind of held on top of whatever it is, top of a church steeple or top of somebody's house. Now here we want to have an E and that's going to be slightly thicker there. That's going to be hidden behind. So we'll see a bit of thickness there. And then here we will want to have north. So that will go up there like that. <laughs> have to think about this and that will go there like that and that will come down and then that will want to go up and across and down across up and down like that uh, <laughs> there we go when you are sure that the ink is dry then you can erase all those pencil lines and then I'm going to shade in this the comb on the top like that and then we want to make this look a little bit kind of shiny and metallic so we're going to draw do shading all the way around underneath there there and then we probably want some shading on the tail and we can shade the lettering too now while i'm doing this if you watch this far you obviously love drawing so why not subscribe to draw stuff real easy and then you will get notifications of my new videos every monday and thursday 4 p.m uk time will come to your notifications in youtube in your inbox so click that button and subscribe just a little bit more around there and then i don't know why i feel i need to put a bit more there and i think what i'm going to do is i'm going to draw a kind of horizon in the background and I'm just going to draw like it's kind of trees or something like that. It's in the distance. And if you really want, then we can have some clouds in there as well.
And if you want to know how to draw clouds, <laughs> I've done a video on that, click up here to see that. And there you go, how to draw a weathercock weather vane. Well, thanks for watching. Please like this video and make sure you are subscribed to the Draw Stuff Real Easy channel. You can support my videos by following me on my Patreon page. Put your drawing idea requests in the comments box below and remember to keep drawing, drawing, drawing. Practice, practice, practice and I'll see you next time. You take care now. Bye bye.